The controversy by no means is confined to Arizona. The national spotlight is now shining big and bright on the Grand Canyon State. Case in point, take a look at this sign hung in a Tucson pizzeria threatening to refuse service to Arizona lawmakers. It's gone viral, a trend that has some wondering if Arizona's tourism industry will take a hit, especially on sports' biggest stage. Not on your sides, Maggie Vespa joins us live from the newsroom with more. That's right, guys. Stella. Critics are quick to compare 1062 to the state's hot-button immigration bill, SB 1070. And tonight, some say this controversial combo platter is pulling the welcome mat right out from under Arizona. They say it's happened before. Back in 1993, the NFL blew the whistle on Arizona's Super Bowl dreams. The flag on the play? Failure to make Martin Luther King Day a holiday. They said, we'll wait until you understand civil rights. Now, Tucson city leaders worry the state's image has taken too big a blow. First from its show me your papers law, now the religious freedom bill. We did 1070, now we're doing this, and this is another opportunity for the NFL to take a look at our state and say, we'll hit the pause button on Arizona. We're getting phone calls from people that are very upset. Tourism experts say no question 1070 has led to canceled conventions and vacations alike. If 1062 is signed, they expect a similar slump. They tell us, we love Arizona, it's great, we know that it's a good place, but my customers, those that are going to be attending the conference, I don't know what they think. And concerning the Super Bowl, even if it stays here, experts predict it will end up a Sochi style situation where side coverage of the Olympics wasn't devoted to Russia's scenery and culture, but its politics and PR problems. Now, both Visit Tucson and the Arizona Lodging and Tourism Association have asked Governor Brewer to veto 1062. We also reached out to the NFL, but have not heard back. Live in the newsroom, I'm Maggie Vespa. Kegan 9 on your side.